my god, I'm finally done! Jeez! It took forever! Welcome back, guys. My name is Valencia, and I am the Game Mistress, and today we are hopefully going to finish Little Inferno. You know what? No. We are going to finish Little Inferno. I don't care how long it takes me. I don't work for, like, three more hours, so we are going to finish this game. I have now done every single combo, as you may or may not have seen. I'm not sure if I'm going to, like, put it right at the beginning of the video and just, like, super fast forward, as you can see how my frustration... I had to use the internet because some of these were like impossible. Like, what was the hardest one for me that I would have never thought of? This yellow brick road. A cat, a scarecrow, and then a robot. Like, I get the Tin Man kind of thing, and I, I guess Lion and Scarecrow, like, I guess, but I would have never figured it out. I would have never figured that out. So, anyway, I finished all the combos, and I received this letter right here that I'm about to open, and then after I open this and see what it says in this, then I'm going to buy uh, Sugar Plump stuff, and then we're going to see what happens at the end of the game. So this is either going to be a very short video, as in not much else happens after this, or a longer one, because I don't know if something else is after this. But I want to finish this game today. I just want to get it done. So, <clears throat> Ooh, congratulations. Ugh, hair's in my mouth. Sorry. You have found every combo, which means you have achieved Platinum Rainbow Elite status in the Tomorrow Corporation Combo Loyalty Program. Your time and effort have been well spent. As a special reward for your hard work and loyalty to Tomorrow Corporation, Tomorrow Corporation would like to honor your exceptional loyalty with the attached gift. Love, Miss Nancy. Enjoy! Ooh! Novelty Mouse Pad! I saved her little heart. It's too late now. I already put it in there. It's getting burned! Holy shit! I mean, I didn't need all of those. Holy shit, though. Oh, I should. I wish I had saved that. It doesn't matter. Like, it's not going to take me that many stamps to buy the thing Sugar Plums want me to buy. What was the thing she wanted me to buy again? I forget. Um, she wanted me to buy sunglasses, the magnet, the fireflies, and then the toy exterminator. Just to make sure, I'm going to reread this. The fireflies, the magnet, the little exterminator, and fashionable sunglasses. Do you remember? Blah, blah, blah. It's time. Okay. No, get out of here. Get out of here! Can I not, like, I, I guess I can't burn that letter. I have to burn the things together. So. That mouse pad, though. Holy shit, man. Patience is a virtue, though. Like, because I had so many magnets that I was able to use because I'd been saving up for so long. Anywho. Let's use some of these magnets. And burn this shit together. Did I? Anybody else hear that sound? Oh god. Oh god, all my stuff went away. Its mouth is opening! Was its mouth always open? Okay, no, it definitely wasn't. Error, 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 error. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. What's happening? I just got chills. I don't know what to, I don't know what to do. Sugar plums. What is going on? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my stamps! The money! I want the money! Its eyes are opening! Its eyes are opening! Oh my god! chills right now. What the fuck? Holy shit! Holy fuck! That 
That's why I wanted to do all the combos first. What the fuck? That's what I look like? Which one is this? Is is can I? Oh, I have to click and move. Is this one that I'm standing in front of supposed to be Sugar Plump's house? My house, her house burned down. Okay, my house exploded. What is this? The whole game just changed. Can I go back here? No. What is happening? Is it ash or is it snow? A person. Hey you! Special delivery! I just found out I exist! <laughs> Don't worry! Just the friendly neighborhood mailman making the rounds! Oh, okay, so there was an actual mailman coming to my house and delivering stuff. We're all gonna be fine! Now, what was your address again? Sorry, I'm probably really loud because the music is really loud in my ears. Sorry! <clears throat> I think I burned down my house. Yes, your home address appears to uh, your home address appears to have been recently oh delisted. Are you moving? Don't forget to file a change of address form with your local post office. One moment while I find your letter. I know it's here somewhere. He must like know me because like he delivers to my house like every day. You smell familiar. Oh, well, I've delivered, let's see, 472 packages and letters directly to your house. Oh my god. Each package and letter I placed right there, right beside you, right beside the fire. You never even had to turn around. Excellent, discreet service. On-time delivery, through snow or rain, but mostly snow. It's been, getting, it's been getting colder lately, hasn't it? Aha! Here's your letter. Thanks, but I'll probably cook food as fast as I can and then burn it. No, I actually read the stuff. I'm sure it'll keep you warm. Salutations. Sincerely, all the best. Kind regards. Goodbye. We're all gonna be fine. Okay. Sugar plums! Look at her! She's so pretty! Oh, it's so bright. Are you still there? Remember a long time ago? Like, I don't know how to do her voice anymore. I give up, okay? You and me, and the wall between us, threw things in the fire for hours and days. It was so warm, like a bug and a mug and a hug. We thought we'd never run out of toys. We thought we'd never run out of time. Where did they all go? Ha <laughs> ha! Up. Up the chimney like everything else. Oh! There's something I wanted to tell you! She, she definitely feels like she definitely looks different than like before. Did you know? I didn't burn up! The house burned it down! And then I left just like you. There's a whole world out there. You can go as far as you want, but you can never go back. What? I'm at the beach, getting a great tan! Okay, thanks for the sunglasses! I can't believe how fabulous I look! Smooch! Your friend, SP. She didn't even say sugar pumps this time. She's a different person. Can I not do anything with the lever letter? Okay, so... I guess I'll just leave the letter there and just... Keep going? Oh. Doesn't seem like I can go into any of these places. What? This game is completely. What? You guys are the ones who've been singing this whole time? Okay, I'm just gonna keep waddling along. Tomorrow, Corporation. There's a person. Oh. Hello? Yes, welcome! The gates are secure! You probably shouldn't be outside. Hey, what's that shadowy building back there? Oh. <clears throat> Whoa! 
Welcome to Tomorrow Corporation. The future is tomorrow. <laughs> I'm, is this is the second time that you used to be a bus driver. Oh, do you recognize my work? Yes, I seem to have made quite a name for myself in the liver operating business. Maybe you've heard. I'll be giving a seminar at the upcoming Future Innovations in Lever Operating Technology Conference. They have a conference for that? Jeez. You should stop by. I can introduce you to some excellent networking opportunities. Bring your resume and business cards. The machinery won't operate itself, you know. You might recognize such Tomorrow Corporation toys as Fisty's Gem Pop. Or My Childhood, The Game. Or Little Infernal Entertainment Fireplace! Hold on, were those other two things that he just said, like, actually games that were made by the same company? Or no, because the 50s, the 50s Gem Pop was a game in here. What was the other one he said? I don't remember. They probably, I don't know. You look like you might be a fan of one of those three. I'll cover it and sit there. Will you open those scary gates so I can go inside? Can I open those scary gates? My one single job, the only job I was hired to do, the one thing I do better than anybody else, is open those gates! So if you're gonna ask, ask again, with drama! Will you open the gate so I can go inside, please? And? What? Think of the drama! This is kinda hurting my voice, I'm still recovering from being sick. This is the moment you pass through the through the gates. What's in that building? You could find a room that glows as bright as the sun. Or you could find an elevator that only moves up. Or you could find a monster with a heart of gold. Or a fantastic summer internship. But whatever is through those gates, you'll never be able to know again. So, once again, with feelings. Gate operator, open the gates. Haha, <laughs> nimble fingers, here we go! Stand back! Let's see what happens this time! <laughs> it's a lot of lever operating just to open those gates. Holy shit, I got chills from that again. I'm getting lots of chills at the end of this game! Oh my god! I didn't think it would be this badass of a gate opening sequence. Oh my god. Can you see him? Can you see my chills? I don't know if my camera's picking it up. Oh my god. I go. Is that the end? I just walk into to Kamara and into Tomorrow Corporation? And just, oh. Guess I wasn't the end yet. <clears throat> yes. Welcome to Tomorrow Corporation. How may I direct your call? More great information about Tomorrow Corporation? Two, complaints and lawsuits regarding Little Inferno Entertainment Fireplace. Three, speak to an operator. Uh... We'll start with more information. We'll just go in order. Yes, Tomorrow Corporation. The future is tomorrow. It's also on our website. Please go there. Okay. I have a complaint. My house burned down. Yes, thank you. Please provide the following. Your home warranty alphanumeric product code. Your 16-digit personal customer identification confirmation validation number. Your little inferno certificate of authenticity you received with your product. You will need to fax those materials to the number listed on our website. And of course, I burned all that shit down. I don't have a fax machine. I don't think anybody does. Also, my house burned down. Yes, I will wait for your fax. Thank you. I'd like to speak to an operator, please. Zero, zero, zero. Yes, please hold. Hello? How may I help you today? What are you writing there? Yes, this communication may be recorded for quality or evaluation purposes. It looks like you're writing more words than we're saying. Yes, I'm writing a novel in the other window. In each brief pause, 
between each word. Your multitasking skills are excellent! Yes, thank you. What's your novel about? Yes, my novel is a smoldering work, a mystery, a romance, a forbidden affair, a murder, a heart burns. It's pretty much an autobiography. <laughs> what is your book called? Yes, my novel is called Smokestacks Over Burnington. A thrilling follow-up to my last novel, The Terrible Secret, which was one of the things that I was able to burn. What is The Terrible Secret? Yes, it is terrible. How may I help you today? Can I go up that elevator? Yes, thank you for your request, but the elevator is for authorized Tomorrow Corporation employees only. May I use the restroom? Yes, the restroom is just up that elevator. Okay, thanks, bye! Yes, thank you for your... For... Querying... I don't know how to say that word. Don't say I'm stupid. Tomorrow Corporation. Remember, the future is tomorrow. Okay, so, at first, I'm sorry, that elevator is only for employees. Yes, the restrooms are right up that elevator. Like, I'm a smart little fucking dude. Look, the squirrel. The squirrel toy. Can I go in any of these rooms? There's a bicycle toy. And the robot dude. I didn't see no bathroom. Oh! Welcome. Oh, it looks so cold out there. How long has it been snowing? Oh! It's been snowing for as long as I can remember, and it's been getting colder. Excuse me. Every day colder than the day before. That can't last forever. Oh, but it, it's beautiful, isn't it? What? What can't last forever? Can you see down there? Look as far as you can. Everything you see, the whole city, it's slowing down. And then one day, it will stop frozen like a family photo. Awesome, you're terrifying. I'm glad we're friends. <laughs> um, that's horrible. Shouldn't we do something? Oh, it's nobody's fault. We can't control the weather. If everything is freezing, why doesn't everybody leave? You burned down your house. And you left. Where will you go next? You can go as far as you like, but you can't go back, and you can't come with me. Okay, I'm going to ask this one now. Oh, yes, I'm Miss Nancy. Welcome. Have you enjoyed yourself? Oh, I already knew she was Miss Nancy. You made Little Inferno. Oh, yes, yes, I built this company. I hope Little Inferno kept you nice and toasty warm. My house burned down. Yes, Tomorrow Corporation regrets any inconvenience that that may have caused. You look like you could use a hug. Oh, do you remember? I sent you a coupon good for one free hug a long time ago. Did you bring it? I did keep it! Oh my, there it is. We haven't printed these in years. Years? How long was I sitting in my house? Get ready to snuggle up with Miss Nancy. Oh, God. So weird. What? Are you leaving, too? Oh, yes. I've just finished packing. You're just in time. I've been here too long, and I'm not getting any younger. Although, I do look fantastic for my age. There was so much more I wanted to do. Where did all the time go? Oh, it's easy to forget. Remember when I wanted to be an astronaut and explore the cosmos and compose a symphony and dive into the bottom of the ocean and discover lost cities and build new cities and become a model before you know it? Oh! Are you going to burn down your house too? Oh! <laughs> What should you do when you've already got everything you've ever dreamed? I don't know. What should you do when you've already got everything you've ever dreamed? Dream bigger! Okay. Thank you for stopping by. Oh, it's been a pleasure. It's time. It's time! Mmm, mmm, mmm. Whee! I don't know 
like how to do that part of her voice like I don't know and then she just left me Does she build a giant fucking rocket ship? Is she just gonna go in space now? Bye! You had plenty of more windows. I totally could have gone with you. No, I gotta find sugar plumps. She's at the beach! That's a huge rocket, though, seriously, for just one person. Two more rockets just sprouted out. Okay, bye! My little kid's like, Take me with you! Alrighty. I can't. Okay, guess I'll go back this way. Can I go into any of these doors now? No. I didn't get to use the bathroom. Am I even a kid? Like, it looks like I have a tie. Am I an adult? Can I talk to you? Yes. <clears throat> Sorry, I forgot her voice. Yes, thank you for queuing tomorrow, Corporation. Remember, the future is tomorrow. Okay. Can I talk to this guy again? Welcome to... Oh! How can I help you? Oh, so I can go back in. Have you tried going that way? That way over there? Where my fingers are pointing? To the right? It turns out... There's a whole world out there! Let's go! I'm a slow walker. My little tiny stick legs. Hello? Oh! Oh! The weatherman! Breaking weather forecast! A clear horizon as far as the eye can see! Are you ready to go? Yes, I'm ready. Woo wee! Here we go! Just close your eyes, walk forward, and believe! Really? I just walk off the edge of this big scary cliff and believe? Okay, here I go! Whoa, hey here! Or, hey there, kid! Ah, <laughs> just kidding. It's all sharp rocks and sharks down there. And you? Oh, yo, that's a long fall! I cannot read this guy. He's so weird. I can take you up, up, up out of this city. But then, you're on your own. You can go as far as you like, but you'll have to pay as you go. And you can never go back. You sure you're ready? Yes, I'm sure I'm ready. I want to get to Sugar Plums. Breaking weather forecast! The sun is so big you can almost touch it! This is the beginning of something brilliant. Reporting from the weather balloon over the smokestacks over the city. Good night! Is that the end? Little Inferno. Oh. oh, that's the end! Oh, that was great. Sorry, my nose is still running. Ugh, I'm still trying to not be sick. Oh, so did I find, did I get to Sugar Plumps? Or what? Because that's my main thing. Like, did I find Sugar Plumps? Because I want to have found Sugar Plumps. Oh, man. I don't even know like what to say about this game besides I love this game. It's a great game. It really was. The end, like, I've never gotten that many chills from like playing a game before. 
Like, the ending of that game was... I don't know, just like the sound effects, like, especially when the guy was opening the gate. I just... Yeah, I wish I knew what to say, but it's like, I don't know what to say. Let's see if there's, like, an, another scene or something. No? That's it. That is it. That's it. That's the end of Little Inferno. Well, I think I did everything. Now it has a sun instead of stars. I got I got all of the combos. So I even got that little bonus thing. And I kept the hug coupon, so I even got to hug Miss Nancy. I knew I should have kept that. I knew I should have kept that hug coupon. Because they made it such a big thing throughout the whole game that like just burn everything that like I just had this gut feeling that there was going to be something in excuse me, in the game that it was like if if you can control yourself and not burn everything, you will get something in return. But on the other hand, like I got a lot more in return for burning literally everything, getting every combo. I got like crap ton of stamps. But that game I mean I don't know what was going on with the whole city being frozen and this like Miss Nancy like made this fireplace that was basically the fireplace is what keeping is what was keeping everybody from leaving and not staying there or and staying there and freezing to death. If people's houses would just explode like mine, they'd know to leave. But I don't know. That game it, it's not one of my it's definitely not one of my favorite games, but for like the art style was awesome just the way things were I love how the game like after your house blew up it transitioned so, like the style like the play style of the game transitioned it was so different from like sitting in your fireplace for hours and hours and hours apparently years upon years and then now you're just in this actual world and you're like I just found out that I actually exist and now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna travel out of this place and find sugar plumps because she was happy on the beach and like you could see the transition from like when you first got letters from her she kind of looked like a mess like flustered you know and then like at the end she like her hair was all done she had lipstick on she was all pretty it was like she's actually living her life so I guess that's kind of almost like a message to people out there kind of like me is like don't just sit and just do one thing just because it makes you happy like, yes, do it and be happy, but how can you know if there's not something else out there to make you happier if you don't go out and you don't try and find it? So that's what I'm trying to do here with YouTube. But anyway, I've been rambling too long, and I feel like most of you probably don't care. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. If you guys like this game, I'll try and remember to put a link in the description below. It's on Steam. I think it's like 10 or $15. Um, they've made the same people who have made this game have made um, other games that I'm thinking I might go and play um, but like I said if you guys liked this game go check it out if you like this video hit that like button and if you really like this video feel free to subscribe to my channel but no pressure because I mean never want to force anybody to do anything they don't want to do but anyway like I said thank you guys so much for watching and as always stay classy my friends bye bye Oh god! Jump! Oh god. Um, so are you just gonna like leave the door open and let Milton in here? When I'm about to try and record. He's annoying. Meow! Meow!